Hey everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today I'm going to show you how to create this cartoon spiral background in just a few simple steps. So let's begin. We will start off by creating a new composition. In this new composition, you're going to create a new solid layer. So after you're done creating the solid layer, you're going to apply the effect of a gradient ramp on this solid layer. And here I'm going to turn the ramp shape into a radial one and make sure the center is the start of ramp is placed at the center. And then I'm going to change the colors and you can change it to whatever you want. Then I'm going to change the ramp scatter to around 240. So this light pink color spreads a little bit more on your gradient. Now in order to create the cartoon spiral background effect so we're going to select the pen tool make sure your fill is turned off and your stroke is turned on next we're going to turn on our proportional grid so we know where the center of our composition is so we're just going to select the center point and then I'm going to zoom out to around 6.25 percent and hold down the shift key and create a straight line going out of your composition what I'm going to do next is turn off our proportional grid because we don't need it anymore and here I'm going to change the stroke size to around 150 next in the shape layer option which is the line that you have just created you're going to go towards the content and the stroke one and then scroll down below to the taper settings and here change the start length to around a hundred so you have this shape so what I'm going to do now is just reduce the length a little so this is the effect that we have so far next in the shape layer option you're going to add the repeater property so in the repeater one option in the transform repeater one option you're going to change the position X to a zero and I'm going to change the rotation to around 15 degrees so as you can see we've already started to create a background and here the next thing that you're going to change is the increase the copies to around 30 until it fills up your entire screen now in order to give this background some movement what we're going to do is in the shape layer in the rotation option hold down the alt and press this rotation stopwatch and type in time steric 20 so basically what this does is it will start rotating your background so to make it look even more realistic what you're going to do is turn the shape layer to an overlay blending mode and now you have a spinning rotation spiral effect as you can see if you're interested in more adobe after effects tutorials please make sure you subscribe to my youtube channel and i will see you guys in my next video take care bye